Hello and welcome. My name is Courtney. Thank you for joining me in this Obsidian Crystal Guided Meditation. For this meditation, if you have an Obsidian Crystal, that is wonderful as we will be using it. If you do not, do not worry for this meditation is a visualization exercise as well. So you may envision an Obsidian Crystal with you. This meditation will connect you to the energy of black obsidian and will also be working in tandem with your root chakra. Let's get ready to dive into this obsidian crystal meditation. I invite you to close your eyes, making it as comfortably dark as you please. Maybe placing something over your eyes, something soft and cozy. Find yourself in a comfortable position. For this meditation, I advise to lay flat if possible. Once you have gotten in a comfortable position, we will start off with your obsidian crystal in your non-dominant hand. Again, if you do not have an obsidian crystal with you, that is okay. Simply imagine it wherever I call upon it on your body. Let's now start with three big inhales. Notice your shoulders loosening. Let out any tension in the heels of your feet. Find stillness in this moment. Let us bring our awareness to the obsidian crystal in our non-dominant hand. Grasp this crystal, feel the sensation of the obsidian in your hand, release your thoughts, and give the obsidian a slight squeeze. Let your body sink into the floor, sinking deeper, more comfortable than before. Know that everything is okay in this moment. You have nowhere to be nothing to do. You are here to simply feel into your body and truly connect with the energy of obsidian. Black obsidian powerfully eliminates negative energy in oneself and one's environment. It cleanses the auric field like a vacuum, sucking up negativity, disharmony, anger, greed, fear, any lower vibration from your energetic field will be released during this meditation. This is truly an opportunity to let go and release what is no longer serving you. Let your mind drift off as you feel so safe and content in this moment. A feeling of ease surrounding your body, mind, and soul. Let's take a few breaths here as you connect with your obsidian. Grasp the stone in your hand. Notice the energy in the palm of your hand. The obsidian crystal is activating protection and the removal process within yourself. Before we dive into this healing work, I want you to imagine a cord within you that is holding you back from developing into the highest version of you. Black obsidian acts as a tool to help us examine our own thoughts illuminating negative thoughts and mental habits so action can be taken to clear their root causes. It allows one to perceive where one is creating negativity in one's own life and guides one to change the underlying patterns that create negative reality. Take a moment here to breathe and think of the shadow within yourself. Face this shadow with your obsidian crystal.
Imagine your obsidian is in front of you, simply floating right in front of you. The obsidian is now growing larger and larger and is forming a seven foot tall mirror. You notice your reflection in the darkness, this glass-like black water. You gaze into your eyes, noticing yourself like you've never seen yourself before. The light in this reflection, you notice the curve of your nose, the height of your brows, the fullness of your lips, your face, this is you. Why is it you've never seen this reflection before? Is your clouded judgment filling your mind, assigning flaws that are nowhere to be found? As you gaze into this mirror, reflect on the casual negative self-talk that you may face daily, as many humans tend to do. What are the parts of yourself that you deem no good, that you hide and criticize? Take a moment to define your shadow. One minute of room noise. In these moments, I want you to visualize that cord, this binding cord that binds your past self to your future self. Now that we have established the shadow, the cord, let us now heal the shadow by placing the obsidian crystal from our non-dominant hand to the root chakra. This energy lays at the base of the spine for now, we can place the obsidian crystal between the thighs. You may also rest the obsidian between your ankles or below your feet, whatever your preference is. Let the energy of obsidian settle here and clear any blockages that may be apparent. Those words of discouragement, anxiety, a failure, a false belief that you are not capable of creating what you truly want in life. Those thoughts and feelings are being confronted and healed. Black Obsidian is a powerful emotional teacher. It is aiding you in this moment to understand and accept the darker side of your true nature, as this part can be evolved and illuminated and served as a catalyst towards your development. Once again, envision this cord binding you from your past life to your future self. We are going to energetically Cut this cord with scissors in your right hand between the two blades place the cord tight and cut take a deep breath here and concentrate on obsidian's protective energy surrounding your root chakra growing larger and larger with light surrounding your body Take this moment to reflect on your strength, your willingness to recognize your shadow and walk into your light. Let's take a few deep breaths here. Stay. One minute of room noise. I invite you to remove the obsidian crystal from your root chakra and place it in your dominant hand. You may feel very activated in this moment. Take as long as you need to slowly get back into a dreamier, relaxed state. As we have accomplished this energy work, cutting the cord, 
we may feel as though a weight has been lifted. Let us now affirm this release and let go of the past. Let us state out loud, I cleanse my energy field of negativity and ground myself to the earth. Once again, I cleanse my energy field of negativity and ground myself to the earth. This potent, renewed energy is filling your dominant hand, the obsidian sucking up the last bit of noxious energy left over from this release, from this cut. As you're starting to feel a new sense of energy being replaced in your body. You feel your body in this moment feels lighter from when you first started this meditation. In this moment, let's make this the biggest breath to really push out that very last bit of stagnant energy. The biggest breath you've done. Here we go. Take some deep breaths here. Slowly take your time to come back to your body. Slowly, slowly coming down, hovering over your physical body, melting and merging with the self. Steady your breaths. Maybe wiggle your toes a bit. Feel a smile creep on your face, a joyous feeling to be back, welcoming a day here on earth. <laughs> Take as long as you'd like to return to your day and admire your obsidian crystal for all the work you did together. I hope this meditation was one that brought you a sense of renewal to really rid of anything that's been holding you back lately. You have the power in this moment to start over, to feel good, to know you deserve to feel good. Thank you so, so much for being here. And I'm excited to see you in my next crystal meditation. Namaste.